Mapazore, Delight Mapazore. Do you know what? You should have your own fashion label because let me just step back. Look at you, you look fantastic. You. What were you doing here for the Women Leading in Business Network event today? What were you doing here? Well, I've been speaking about my journey. So I, I own a food brand called Kaysvoz. We make South African inspired beautiful sausages. Been in business since 2016. And I've been here today just sharing some nuggets on leadership and how to run business. So I'm Mickey from Kai Empowerment CIC and I happen to be on the panel today. So again, Kai Empowerment is based in Wigan and we work with women and children from underrepresented communities. Claire Marie, I'm going to fire questions at you quickly, Claire Marie, because you're a busy woman. Right, okay. How's it gone for 2022 Women Leading in Business? We have had a fabulous year. Um, we have had quite a lot of online events and two in-person events, so one in July and one today in December, and we have had record numbers. I think there were about 42 people in the room and 32 online, so we're absolutely delighted with that. And um, you're looking forward to 2023? Definitely, definitely, and we've taken the decision that our 2023 events will be hybrid, so people can dial in from anywhere in the world and also meet in person for those that want that 3D experience. Are you really, really like happy that this is I uh, is a truly diverse network? You know, diverse from an ethnicity point of view, but also as well internationally and intersectionality wise. Definitely, and it's one of the things that I'm um, really interested in. I like bringing people from different areas, different domains, different ages, just lots of differences together and see what happens. It's just an experiment for me. I love to see the, the chemistry and the, the collaboration that plays out. So, um, yeah. Come along and um, it's called Women Leading in Business, but you don't even have to be a woman to be in it. So it's the last uh, Women Leading in Business at the Alliance Manchester Business School event. We normally have it online, but this is a hybrid event. And um, you can tell the two of the people I'm going to speak to, one of them is not a woman. Hi, Danny. Hi. And here's Sue. She is definitely a woman. <laughs> Hello. Uh, <laughs> So uh, I'm going to go to you, Danny. Yeah. You come to this um, uh, network. It's open to all. We're very yes. inclusive. Why did you come? Why did I come? I think I, I certainly get a different viewpoint from a business point of view, a business understanding. Um, there's no other network like it. You know, and I don't think there are many men like me that, that are, that are um, open to coming to events like this. So that's why I come. Uh, you know what? We welcome allies. This is that's great. That's fantastic. I'm a big advocate. Yeah, that's fantastic. Are you listening, guys? Big advocate. Right. Okay. I should even, I should introduce you to Lee Chambers. He's one of uh, one of my contacts. Yes. Um, I'm inviting to the network. Sue, how are you, my darling? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. It's uh, been a wonderful chance to meet everybody back in person. It feels like a really good celebration of everything over the last 12 months that we've managed to witness online. And as Claire Marie says, it's the, the beating heart that keeps us all moving forward these networking events. Yeah. They're just absolutely an amazing place to come and really meet friendly, open people who want to talk about business, business development, and, and really how we can support each other. That's fantastic. And you can hear in the background, she never shuts up. Thank you, <laughs> Danny and Sue. You're welcome. Do you mind explaining what it is? Because I'm asking. 